to the mothers that have the luxury of having the child's father around. To the mothers that have the luxury of being able to get a day or two to yourself. To the mothers that have more than just three or four people in the village. Please appreciate that. Because the mothers that don't, I'm tired. Like, I just had the stomach virus for like a couple hours, literally. I'm feeling much more better now, but physically I'm tired. I ain't gonna lie, like, I really don't like that I still have to be a mother even when I'm sick and weak. But I just want to rest and sleep. I have to keep this mask on for my babies because they can't see me right now. Like, I'm so tired of my son crying. I'm tired of breastfeeding right now. I'm tired of cleaning up. I'm tired. I didn't want to be a single mom. I, didn't, I don't deserve to be a single mom. <laughs> My babies deserve to have their dads, but their dads ain't shit. <laughs> so yeah, I took on the role. I took on what I had to take on. I had to be that for my kids, but damn. I want to help me. I want a husband. I want somebody here to give me that breath, to give me that that break, to give me that breather, to give me that space away from my baby. Because <laughs> family members can only do so much. Like, I'm tired of changing diapers. I just, I just want a break. I just want to be able to walk out the door. And just do what I want. But I can't. I can't because my time revolves around them. I deserve a break. I deserve to be happy. Say, why don't you pick on somebody your own disposition? Oh, please, Mr. Barroom Brawler. Don't hurt me or anything like that. <laughs> I bet you are asking yourself, well, you know, my viewers, actually, my subscribers, uh, people that happen across this video who've seen some of my other content, I bet you're asking yourself, uh, well, why are, you, why are you posting this clip again? Why are you posting this clip again? Well, you know, some people probably thought I was being it. Some people probably thought I was fucking with this lady and shit who was in a, having a meltdown because, uh, she was a single mother and she didn't have any backup whatsoever and her kids were sick and she had to stomach flu and all this other bullshit and she intimated as much you know in her video and she said she didn't deserve to be a single mother and whatnot that, that she didn't you know well saying like she didn't have no control that she was a single mother and whatnot and I you know I made my case quite clear in the last that video where I admonished her and I pointed out the multiple forms of birth control and all this bullshit. I'm not going to rehash that, okay? But I will say that, uh, you know, single mothers make single mothers, not baby daddies. You know, black men do not make these women uh, single mothers. Single mothers make that choice consciously and shit when they refuse to use the umpteen million forms of birth control, knowing what could happen if they get pregnant, okay? Knowing what could ha be happening and shit. We're supposed to think you're the most educated uh, you know, the most, uh, s mentally sound in our neighborhoods and that, you know, black men are just a flawed and a problem and we need, uh, therapy and we need to course correct ourselves and 
get in line and shit and make the math math and you know that what you know that's what you guys have been telling us for decades and shit. not hundreds of years and shit just you know the whole bag of bullshit you know we're just tired of tired of we're not buying it anymore okay and it, it's a reckoning okay single mothers make single mothers okay they create themselves they decide to do that to themselves and shit you know do you think if men had had the choice of you know men, if men gave birth think if men gave birth and shit right you, know, you, you think like like some dude want to be uh letting some chick you know bang and shit you know without protection and shit especially if there's multiple forms imagine if men had multiple forms of birth control they're working on a birth control pill for men and shit. You're going to see some more birth rate drop and shit, you know, for the dudes that want to still stay over here and fuck around, you know, and play Russian roulette with their penis and their uh, fucking financial stability. So, yeah, I posted this clip again, right? Yeah, you know, I had to stop myself right there because I was about to go on a rant again because this woman really triggers me. She, her and people that talk like her really trigger the fuck out of me and shit. And I want to say that I do have uh, female siblings and cousins and all that bullshit in various states of uh, prosperity or uh, lack thereof and shit. So, you know, it's not like me talking out of my fucking ass and I am a parent. All right. I'm a parent and I'm a baby's daddy and shit. And one, one in one. I'm half and half. All right. So I feel a certain way about this, and which is why I'm revisiting the clip now and shit, because I thought that. You know, maybe we, you know, things would change for this woman. You know, when she, she got well from her malady or whatever. I thought things might change and whatnot. So I decided to, that we all should just, you know, go take a look and shit and see what, what's been going on since she made that fateful post and whatnot. That is all. That is all. I just wanted to follow. This is a follow up. What not. Let's just see, you know, how things have uh, feared since she made this. You know, faithful post. If you let me in, I'ma be your blessing. The way you stress Throw your heart up and dancing. I took my shot, ain't no Smith, ain't no West. I know you got what I want and I got what you need. Know you matching the energy. And I know you feeling me just how I'm feeling. You know you can't hear that you fuck with me. If you let me in, I'ma be your blessing. I ain't the one. I said I still have to be another evil when I'm sick and weak. But I just want to rest and sleep. But I have to keep this mask on for my baby. Say, why don't you pick on somebody your own disposition? Oh, please, Mr. Barroom Brawler. Don't hurt me or anything like that. All these podcasts of me saying like women don't bring anything to the table, women don't do anything, these modern women ain't shit. If y'all want to fuck a man, just say that. You don't got to make a podcast to say how you really feel because it's starting to get suspicious. Either y'all want to deal with women in that bullshit or you don't and you want to deal with a man. What, what what's your what is your other options y'all be talking like y'all got other options what are you gonna do date a fish shut the fuck up and deal with it like we have to baby don't this who y'all want baby this who y'all want betty boo huh this who y'all want huh don't do that this who y'all want huh baby don't do this who y'all want huh i don't lie huh don't do that this is the fuck out of my face this what y'all want huh huh my bitch kids, i told you i told y'all i was gonna embarrass you i don't give my, a fuck fuck your nothing. kids bitch because you don't give a